Hi, I'm Joe James. In this video, I'm going to show you how to delete one or more columns from a pandas data frame. So there are a couple different ways to do this. First, we're going to import pandas as pd. That's normal. Next, we'll load up a data frame. I'm going to call my data frame df, and we're going to do pd.loadcsv. Oops, read csv. And the file I have is one that I've used for some other videos that I've done. So it's called iris.data. And then I'm going to assign some column names, which I have typed up here. Names equals A, B, C, D, and label. Those are my five columns. And then I'll print out that data frame so you can see it. So our data frame looks like this. We have five columns. We're going to go ahead and drop, uh, first we'll just drop one column. How do we do that? We want to delete one column. Let's say we want to delete column B. So we're going to do df dot drop, and then we can just put in parentheses B. And then we need to tell Python that it, this is the vertical axis. So we say axis equals one. That tells it it's the vertical axis. And then we get a data frame back that doesn't have column B in it. However, if I run <clears throat> df here, you can see that the changes didn't persist. So it's important to add this one extra argument. We need to either put uh, here df equals, or a better way to do that is to save our changes to the data frame. Use this argument called in place equals true. And then that will save our changes. So now the data frame doesn't have a column B anymore. What if you want to drop more than one column? Okay. Let's just copy this, paste that down here, and then what we can do, if we want to drop more than one column, we simply pass in a list. So uh, let's drop C and D now, huh? Look, so we got C, and then we'll drop column D. So we're going to drop column C and D. We pass in a list as our first argument, axis equals one, in place equals true, and that will drop two columns. And now our new data frame only has columns A and label. And then another final option here is to drop columns by the column index. So column A is index 0 and label is index 1, right? So if these were numerically labeled, this would be 0 and 1. So we can use those indices for those columns to drop them. And let's see how we do that. We'll copy this. We'll paste it down here. So what we're going to do here is df.columns, and then we'll put square brackets and another square brackets. And then we can put 0, and that's our last uh, column that has numerical data in it. And that's it. So now we dropped that last column. I think that's column A, right? We dropped column A because that's column 0. So df.columns and then a the double square brackets. There's no parentheses here, right? So those are three different ways to delete columns from a data frame. I hope this video was helpful for you. If so, please click the like button and subscribe to my channel. I'm Joe James. Thanks for watching.